Brian Flores landed a new job in the NFL, less than three weeks after he filed a lawsuit seeking class action status against the league and three teams alleging discrimination in their hiring practices. The ex-Dolphins coach will join the Steelers as a senior defensive assistant and linebackers coach, the team announced on Saturday. The opportunity is quite the turnaround for Flores, who was relieved of his duties in Miami after the 2021 season. He posted a 24-25 record in three years with the Dolphins. At the time of Flores' firing, many found the move surprising. The 40-year-old is widely considered to be one of the brightest defensive minds in football and had achieved quite a lot in Miami, with an understocked roster. As a result, NFL fans, media members and former players alike were pleased to see Flores get another opportunity in the NFL with an organization like the Steelers. After spending more than a decade with Bill Belichick and the Patriots, Flores will now have the opportunity to work alongside another well-regarded coach in Mike Tomlin. After Flores firing by the Dolphins, the longtime Steelers leader was the only black head coach in the NFL for a time until Miami hired Mike McDaniel, who is biracial, to replace Flores, and the Texans hired Lovie Smith earlier this month. I am excited about Brian Flores joining our coaching staff. Brian's resume speaks for itself, and I look forward to him adding his expertise to help our team. Flores' lawsuit against the league, Dolphins, Giants and Broncos remained unresolved at this time. The NFL has hired a law firm that includes former U.S. Attorney General Loretta Lynch to defend against the claims. More NFL coverage how the Rams got away, found one another, then found a way Matthew Stafford rewrote his story with a Super Bowl season mailbag, are the Colts really done with Carson Wentz? All Steelers, Steelers interview for more candidates for GM job for more Pittsburgh Steelers coverage, head over to All Steelers.